Hey everyone, Vincent here from creativedojo.net and today in this video, we're going to be covering a quick little plugin called Unmult by Noel, which is a free little plugin that you can get from redgiantsoftware.com. And what it allows you to do is it allows you to actually remove the black from video footage or image in After Effects seamlessly with no hassle, all while maintaining an alpha channel or transparency. Now you're probably wondering, well, why not just set the blending mode to add or screen that will get rid of the black? Yes, but you will run into some problems, which I'll address later in the video tutorial. So let's hop into After Effects here so I can show you what the plugin actually does. So here we have some plain footage of a lighthouse, nothing special here. It's actually here to show you or to better show you what the plugin actually does. So I'm going to bring in an explosion element I have here. By the way, this is not from the Action Essentials 2 package. All the elements from the Action Essentials 2 package already has a built-in alpha channel or transparency. So you're not going to need to do this procedure for those kind of elements. But if you purchase stock footage from another site such as iStock Photo or Video Block or if you even film your own stock footage, you're not going to have an alpha channel already built in. You're actually going to have black by default. That's because it's compressed as a photo JPEG video. So let's get rid of this black the traditional way. Originally, well how you guys would probably think would well, just set the blending mode to screen. And while that did work, you have a pretty crappy explosion here. You can see it's kind of see-through, kind of washed out, kind of transparent, but you don't actually have a true alpha channel. So if I turn off the background layer and turn on the transparency, you see that we don't actually have transparency. It's actually still black. And that's because the blending modes don't react to transparency. The blending modes do not give you transparency or an alpha channel. It actually relies on the bottom layer or another layer for it to blend in properly and give you, you know, transparency. So how do we remove this black background? We're going to use a plugin called Unmult. So search that in and just drag it into your footage right here. And by default, as you can see, we already have a complete alpha channel. So we have a transparent, uh, transparency and alpha channel already in the video footage now. And everything is transparent as it should be. And that's because Unmult uses the black values as transparency. So it's going to use the luminance channel, which is the brightness, to calculate what is transparent and what is not. So if we enable the uh, background layer again and set the blending mode back to normal, you can see that we have a regular, uh, pretty well composited element. Of course, it needs some color correction and such, but it looks better than the screen. So this is what it looks like uh, with the Unmult plugin, and this is what it looks like with the screen. Kind of crappy and washed out, and add. This is a little bit better, except it's a little bit brighter than we want. And it looks kind of crappy and see-through and transparent. So we just use the Unmelt plugin. We can get some pretty decent composites in. Uh, we remove the black. And we also have a true transparent alpha channel, which is really, really nice. And so this is just a very, very basic uh, plugin by Noel. And if you use Noel's Light Factory, you probably are familiar with the command or name Unmelt, because it already has a built-in Unmelt in the Noel's Light Factory for transparency. But this is a very, very quick plugin. Of course, you can apply the Unmult plugin to whatever you want, like optical flares, even though it already has a transparency option built in, I know. Or if you want to, you know, remove the black from footages that are not used for compositing, such as, you know, raindrops or something. If you just want to remove black, this is a very, very simple way to do it. Uh, you can use it on smoke and red blood shots and explosions and whatever you want. Just a really, really quick way to remove black from any video footage. Don't be restricted. So this is a really quick tutorial over the Unmult plugin by Noel, which you can get at redgiantsoftware.com. Thanks for watching, guys. If you liked it, leave a video comment down below. Leave your feedback comment. Don't forget to check out creativedojo.net where we can find more tutorials. Thanks for watching, guys. When you'll see you next time.